what is going on homies it's your voice stumped back from the optc video and in today's video we we're over on stream and we actually had a bunch of news drop within game about the new update 12.0 that will be coming in game as of april 25th it's about a i think it'll be 15 hour maintenance something like that so it does bring stuff like grand voyage it does bring stuff like a super tandem attack also with the new level up system as well. So I thought I would do a video covering it while we were on stream. And basically this is what we spoke about with the chat. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you do, make sure to go down there and belt the like button for me. If you are new to the channel, if you haven't done so already, like 55% of you guys haven't done so. What are you doing? Hit the subscribe button. It's good OPTC content. Most importantly, thank you for watching. Enjoy the rest of your day wherever you are in this beautiful world. And I'll catch you all in the next one. Late. All right, big news. Big news, Morgan. Coming in hot. Big news, Morgan. We have the version 12.0 major version update incoming on the 25th of this month. The 25th of this month. Woo -hoo -hoo. It looks juicy, chat. It looks juicy. Shout out to stream. All right, so Super Tandem is here. After meeting a certain requirement during a quest, you can launch Super Tandem when TND slots appear on the required character. So they're bringing back Tandem slots. Interesting. Connect a tap combo on the required characters in order to hit good or better to launch a powerful and amazing super tandem effect. Okay. Okay. Blast our enemies with super tandem. See, like, tandem was a thing when I started playing, but it was never, like, a thing where it was, like, crazy, like, like this needs to happen sort of thing. Um, it was just sort of, like, whatever at the time anyway. So, kind of cool they're doing super tandem, making it a thing. Very, very interesting. Let's take a look. Um, unlocking Super Tandems. You need to level up potential ability to unlock the Super Tandem. Tap on the Super Tandem button at the Character Detail menu to confirm Super Tandems. Okay, Tandem's back, baby. Level Limit Break is here. Raise a character's character max level with Level Limit Break. With the level limit break, you can get special, like, level 110 from what it seems. Why did they choose Final Tap Luffy as the artwork? Beyond me, but whatever. We move, chat. We move. Uh, special rumble stats. Captain ability. Crewmate ability may become stronger as well. So, power up using the same character from the same evolution tree or a level limit break material. So, there's a new material by the look of it. There is the, uh, is it like a Sugo poster-like material? It looks like a Sugo poster, but... That's kind of cool. Grand Voyage is here. Set sail through the story with more challenges to take on about missions. Each quest will have multiple missions to complete. Mission 3 of 5, 1 of 5. So, clear the quest. Have 6... So, it's just like challenges in the quest, like missions by the look of it. Like... So it's just like, it, it looks like just sort of like a challenge mode from what I can see. As the mission level becomes harder, the mission requirement will become more difficult. Try to take on these missions before, uh, try to take on the missions you feel comfortable completing. There's a mission you should, could not complete. All subsequent missions levels will be considered as incomplete. You also get like, oh, so you get the, this is a way that you get the new... Level limit break materials, okay. And you get bounty and you get rainbow gems, which seems pretty cool. Bounty ranking is here. So, compete in a ranking for personal and alliance. Ba bounty, bounty, I, I like, I understand it's a thing, but I just don't rate it. Like, it's like cool. It's like cool, whatever. Uh, other updates is there's the rainbow gem bazaar added to Rayleigh's bazaar. Okay, that's interesting. And I think that's it. Alright, so that's it. So, basically, the big thing that's coming here. And the big thing to like um, to really take a look at is obviously Grand Voyage. Grand Voyage seems to be starting on the 25th of April. Kind of cool. Pretty much a week from today. Like a week from today is when all of this is going to go live. Um, as for me, it's the 19th. Um, sorry, not when we go live, the maintenance will start. So it'll be like, from what I saw in game, it's the 26th. So for me, it'll be the 27th. Uh, but that's kind of cool. Um, this is the big one here too. Level limit breaking is here. Now, if you're like me and you've been saving dupes of characters, like, this is going to be so good. Like, I've just got so many legends, I'm just going to be like, feed in. Like, just, thank you very much. Um, but obviously the newer legends, it's going to be harder to max them as early as possible. Which I think is like most people's, like, gripe with this particular new mode. So, 
at whilst level limit break does sound very very cool it is a bit of like a like a it's more of a gimmick to make you guys summon for like multiple copies of the character i don't think it's like game breaking in the sense that you're gonna need this like super early but it is cool that they are like limit breaking characters past their max level giving them extra like captain abilities is really interesting this could be a way to like make older characters just better um but like i said we'll have to wait and see um special specials rumble stats is good like obviously rumble stats will go up because like the max level cap's going up so like that's gonna make rumble a little bit more competitive um the captain ability thing to me is the big one crewmate ability sounds pretty cool too like if we can get like some more crewmate stuff that's gonna be kind of fun um the special is really interesting to me like how would they just change specials like i don't know if that's a good or a bad thing and super tandem seems super interesting to me as well hopefully like they don't like because like the thing is right like like i said i wasn't around when tandem was a thing let me know in the comment section below if tandem was even good um i do remember it like happening on my screen but then it sort of just died i was like okay cool like what like whatever when i was like new to the game i had no idea what it did uh it just was like cool animation so like i used to do it uh without knowing like if it did anything really so kind of cool that they're doing this obviously like this tandem effect is to use characters that are like slack like, together so what the one that i remember it was luffy zoro and sanji that was the big one that I used to use um, back in the day when, like, I was very, very new to the game. You'd hit with tandem slots, um, and it would say, like, tandem ready, and then, like, there'd be, like, a cut-in. Um, and it was kind of cool. Um, so, for me, like, I don't know if it'll be, like, good or not. It might be good, but, like, it might not be at the same time. I'm not gonna lie, though. Grand Voyage just seems like... I don't know. It just seems... It doesn't seem like it's new content, right? It just seems like they've added challenge missions, like those bat missions, to stuff that's already there. And if that's the case, I don't really understand why. I guess it's just more rewards. But at the same time, it doesn't fix the big issue with the content cycle, right? It's something you can do all the time, which is great, and there's no rush, but, like, we already had that with, like, garbage challenges, really, like, so I don't know, I, I don't know how sold I am on Grand Voyage, I hope it works, because it seems like they've been putting a lot of energy and a lot of effort into Grand Voyage, um, to me, it just looks like a way to get this, to justify the level limit break, that's, that's what I sort of see here, but, nevertheless, it is a pretty big update coming, the uh, maintenance goes from, um, it, I did see it. It was the 25th to, hang on. Uh, yeah, the 25th, uh, 19, 9 PST, all the way to the 26th. So that is like a, what, 24 minus 9, quick maths, 15 hour maintenance, something like that. And then these are all the things that are coming, so... Seems interesting enough, but uh, if you guys enjoyed the video, let me know what your thoughts are on the update in the comments section below. If you did enjoy the video, make sure to smash the like button for me if you are new. Hit that big red subscribe button too, but guys, wherever you are in this beautiful world, please remember to enjoy the rest of your day. As always, homies, I thank you for watching, and I'll catch you all in the next one. Later!